The star cluster Trumpler 14 is a glittering jewel in the Carina Nebula. These newly formed hot stars energize a huge cavity within the gas and dust. In energetic X-rays, star clusters Trumpler 14 and 15 blaze brightly, along with the massive star Eta Carinae. Mysterious diffuse X-rays appear to emanate from the boundaries between gas and dust. The nebula expelled by Eta Carinae is tremendously bright in infrared light. Infrared showcases the dust surrounding cavities of gas throughout the nebula. The Carina Nebula is a vast and complex cloud where tens of thousands of stars have formed. Off to the side is a smaller nebula called Gum 31. Seemingly separate in visible light, dust connects the structures in infrared light. The cavity of Gum 31 is created by the star cluster NGC 3324. Hundreds of newborn stars are revealed in X-rays. High-energy radiation from the massive stars creates a sharp boundary between the gas and dust. Heated dust molecules break apart to become ionized atoms of gas. These boundaries, known as ionization fronts, can resemble mountainous landscapes. This Webb Space Telescope infrared image is nicknamed cosmic cliffs. The cliffs within the image are actually dust clouds. Blasted by stellar winds and energetic radiation, some form pillars that point back toward the star cluster. Resembling mist on mountainsides, ionized gas rises and streams away from the dust clouds. A new star forming deep within the clouds spews out long jets of energetic particles. The cliff edges illustrate the sharp boundary between cold dust and hot gas. Star formation occurs throughout the Carina Nebula complex. Dust clouds collapse to form stars. Clusters of newborn stars energize their surroundings. Stellar winds and radiation carve cavities within the dust clouds. Multi-wavelength observations from NASA space telescopes provide diverse views to examine and explore the universe.